guys, uh, let's do veracity because I, uh, I I keep saying uh, it's one uh, I have I haven't changed my mind about, but it's still being requested by many. I didn't cover it last week. Uh, let's just quickly check what happened uh, with the price since the last time we looked at it. Uh, if you are missing any information, I suggest just go back on my previous streams as well and check what I uh, covered. Uh, in general, my outlook on veracity hasn't changed. Uh, it's quick, quickly just looking at it. Um, we've lost a key level that we've been hanging uh, around for a while. Wow. So I actually didn't even know this. Um, I'm going to leave those lines up above. Uh, they don't really matter to us anyway. Uh, it's an interesting uh, thing to see anyway. Once we go, uh, get uh, going, um, and hopefully we'll get going eventually and uh, see those all time highs. This is a weekly chart and we've been hovering around that 35 um, mark for a while, but I see it's been lost. So we saw um, we saw this. Um, we saw this big drop here now, actually, our last two weeks ago, started two weeks ago. So that's a, a two week, two weeks ago, close of this candle. I'm just. Uh, my cables are in the way sorry guys but i'm looking at those emas and you can see now uh, we have been trading below this on the weekly for how long since that drop last year nearly a whole year it, it failed this breakout touched the 50 on the weekly as a resistance and went back down it's coming back down and this is um like one of the biggest and shoulders first of all and sadly i have been saying before that i do feel the veracity is going to go lower um and even looking around this range like i have this yellow line here in around uh two three uh so that is a zero dot zero zero two three five ish um as and when we, when you zoom in on the chart, you kind of see why this even going lower uh, at a zero, uh, uh, rounding it up to zero point zero zero two ish. Um, I just want to check something real quick. I mean, guys, what's more there to say really about veracity that you should really look at? much lower than we are right now now or even on the weekly we are just way below i mean obviously ads are so different than bitcoin and how they colorate any drop in Bitcoin, a uh, small percent will annihilate uh, alts. And then when Bitcoin starts moving, it doesn't mean that our alts are going to move, most likely. And again, I'll say this, guys, watch that stream myself and Bleeding Crypto had yesterday. So much amazing information out there. Let's like I, I'm go I'm going to repeat myself from previous streams. I've been seeing these levels for a while. It's just been um on the three daily you will see that uh, uh cluster of candles here. You know, I, I've I've marked this as a yellow line here, uh it, because it was just that level where it kind of bounced, it gave us a couple of fake outs and then uh, it was a resistance here and then it was obviously flipped eventually and um, we've seen this move uh, from this level on. Uh, it's in around like where you see this little candle here on February 21st and then candle here. This is a three daily chart. So um, this is just to kind of mark a zone. Um, what's happening here? It's just it fell. Uh, we, we, we just failed to keep that um support here at three five ish uh fell down fell through that level 
and it's in this range purposely i'm not adding you know a lot more lines these are just kind of levels where i'd be looking at um it's just so hard to predict exact dot to what it's going to fall down to but it is looking like veracity market is just so weak veracity is just getting a lot of beating and it's not like we we weren't prepared for it it's not like um we weren't expecting this price. It's it's obviously devastating for a lot of the for a lot of the voted holders and believers, especially those um who bought much higher than than this. Like my average uh, price is uh, in around three cents. So it it hurts. It hurts to see this, but this is the 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 reality of it. I already kind of written off this bag as in in the way um i don't think about it as a loss i just have it it's accumulating whenever veracity comes back it just comes back and happy days um it could be years before i see my return it honestly can be years um i'm not expecting veracity to turn and guys uh the reality is as well like a lot of ads don't go up back to their all-time highs um so get yourself prepared for this as well, especially ads that don't really continue on building. They're not improving their tech. They're not improving their reach. They're not building with other um, projects. They're not partnering up with nobody. Uh, they're not um, improving their speed and their tech. They're going to get lost. Veracity seems like a very strong project. It seems like definitely one that has a potential to go higher we're um giving ourselves the best chance possible by researching it and um, following uh the project uh, that we feel passionate about and we we've done our research about there's that's that's the best we can do um in this situation i don't want to bore you too much i'm going to just zoom out real quick guys um these levels haven't changed i've been looking at them you know this is a sharp big sell-off we might see another you know we might see something similar to this price as action here this could even come up here now and um although this week has already kind of taken 50 percent for veracity to do anything and kind of even try to come back up to around the four two ish level here to reclaim this you need to see it tackle that ema and um hold that level just keep an eye uh on the emas um like you know it kind of went up here but the the um uh, 13 was was acting um as a resistance so you you need to see this um at least become support that EMA and then um hopefully hopefully we'll we'll just get eventually you know down down the line I'm 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 expecting this candle obviously to be uh balanced and taken but right now um it look it looks very weak to me uh it would have to look you know catch some bottom retest and um reverse maybe some bullish news maybe some uh bullish reversal on the market temporary uh speaking um i i do think we're going to see even lower um maybe not but from technical point i i'm looking and i've been seeing you know this this was just a very weak support in general um maybe it will hold but it just really depends on look at this look, look um at this level here now and we've been looking and been discussing this level for a while.